Hey beautiful Capricorns, welcome back to the channel everyone. Thank you for joining me here Capricorn. Let's get to your messages. Capricorn. Heart of the sky. What's going on here? So spirits got your back here. You've been divinely guided. You are beloved. You are the heart of the sky. And you are being watched over. Hmm. being protected from some kind of this is karma let's get into the read what is Capricorn being protected from? This is like... Some kind of karma here. Someone's actions and words. Hmm. What's going on here? Some wild woman here. It's like someone going through someone else to get to this high priestess. It's like somebody has a karmic spouse. Ah, uh, this is weird. It's stealing some sort of fear in someone's this is thoughts. Okay, there's some kind of evil eye or jealousy here. Something is coming full circle. It's because you're beloved. Someone is in stealing some kind of negative thoughts in someone's head about you. the frick is this all about? Uh, 
Okay, someone's, someone's like afraid to tell you something, to tell this high priestess something. Someone is afraid to tell this empress high priestess something. There's more going on than meets the eye here. Someone has a karmic spouse and they are instilling negative thoughts into someone's head about you and they are stressed out and they're not sure what to do or who to believe. Someone is depressed and sad. It's to do with karma. Someone is in complete denial about some kind of um, hurtful thing here. about someone's ideas and somebody's money. because you're beloved you're being there is some um, you're beloved Why am I sensing Why am I sensing something here? Hang on. Someone's making up lies here. because you're beloved. Hmm. So I'm going to say it straight up. Somebody is going through someone else to get to a high priestess and it's looking like for money. They're after money. Someone's after money. And it's like they're using someone who you love to get to you. So this could be a family member who you love. They, they're with a karmic spouse. Someone has a, a karmic spouse. And it's almost like they got this plot or this scheme or this plan to like go through someone you care about and love to get to you for financial resources 
That's what's happening. Whoever, if you are the Empress. They got a... Uh, someone is not to be trusted at this time. Because it's almost as if they're trying to like... Because you may have Capricorn. Because you may have a... Or, or this Empress. High Priestess may have acquired a lot of funds it's like someone is like plotting to go through you using someone you care about and love to get to your finances that's what this read is saying there is some kind of karma here that someone is facing Hang on to your coin because somebody is getting greedy here. Somebody's spouse is getting greedy. They're sneaky. Someone's acting very sneaky. And they're acting very um, greedy. They're after some kind of money that this empress has. And you love this person. So it doesn't have to be a romantic connection. It could be family. Using someone to get to you. Someone has a greedy spouse that figures because um someone's spouse here is greedy and it's a feminine to get to capricorn's finances or to get to this empress's high priestess's money someone here is very sneaky and they're very greedy. And they're thinking of ways because they're lacking finances. Like if they came to you directly, you would turn them down flat. If they came to you directly, it would be a holy hell no. I would not help you. So they think that if they can go through a person that you care about to get to you, then they would take that and give it to the, some other person. That's what someone's plotting here. This one. Ah. So, it's because you've hit the jackpot somehow. It's because you got money somehow. And if this person who I'm talking about came to you directly to your face and said, Capricorn, could you give me some money or could you help me out here? You would turn them down flat whoever this person is you would never do it you'd never help them so they got a plan to go through someone else who you do care about who you probably would help there's an in between here there's someone is a wolf in sheep's clothing A 
And in order to dodge some kind of bullet with their spouse, they want to come to you. So they may have spent their money on something else. And so you care about this person. You don't care who uh, for their uh, who their spouse is. You could care less. Uh, you Watch out for ass kissers coming along here. So like someone wants to live the high life. someone is trying to go through someone you care about to get to your money these people ain't shit so it's like yeah I told you because they are in lack of funds And they see you got it. And so you would directly turn this person down, whoever it is. You would say no. You would not help them. So they're planning on the next strategy is to like go to someone that you do love and you do care about to get access to your funds through this person you do care about. They ain't shit. They are wolves in sheep's clothing. Do not help them. That's what the universe is saying. Because it's a con. Someone's a, being a, a con. Uh, it's like... They have a spouse... That is putting them up to come ask you for something. Or whoever this high priestess, um, empress is. Doesn't have to be you. It's like it could be you. You got some money. Or you could be this masculine who has money and it's like this is a karmic spouse this is a karmic spouse who's putting up their person to access funds through you to support some little uh, con artist here Because if, like I said, they're in lack of funds and they see you have it, something going on. These are people who've been talking shit about you behind your back. Now are in need of money. So it's like. You're going to have to be aware. Don't help these people. Sometimes we're not supposed to interfere in karma. Like as much as we care about people. And as much as we love people. Uh, because it's showing you love whoever this is or you have, you know, feelings for this is. This could be your own family or your own children. I don't know. Somebody's got a con artist spouse. They're sleazy. They're slick. They are a con. 
it's like they're greedy and they see that this that you have money you're gonna have to be careful as much as you may want to help as much as you may want to help this person out sometimes you gotta let them get their karma we're not supposed to interfere in what is meant to be it's like you're being clearly told not to assist not financially anyway It's because their freaking spouse is freaking out that they need money. And their spouse is freaking out. So in order to dodge bullets with their spouse, it's like they want to come to you to get some kind of cash. And you're supposed to let them get their karma. Because they got problems, okay? And they've been talking shit behind your back and you know it and you would never help them. You would not. Let them get their karma. We're not supposed to intercede in lessons that the universe is trying to teach people. So it's not going to help them to help them out financially. This is not supposed to be something you help someone out with financially. You can help them out in other ways if you wish to, but you're not supposed to be assisting financially because they want to use their users. Sorry, but they are. Someone's spouse is putting them up to do this. And they think you're just going to give everything to them or give everything away to them. Offer them counseling. <laughs> but don't give money. This is someone you should not be giving money to. Don't give money. There's some karmic lesson that they're supposed to learn. Otherwise, normally, you may assist or whatever but on this one you're not supposed to assist it's like they got to learn their lesson i don't know if these uh, it's a spouse putting someone up someone up that you care about to pull on your heartstrings to give them money so that they can give it to whoever they're giving it to so set up Because that person knows that you would turn them down flat. Okay? You would not give them money. So they go to plan B. Well, how can I scam? How, how can I scam Capricorn out of giving? Well, maybe I'll tell them it's for this reason. Or, or I'll tell them it's for that reason. It's because they have a karmic spouse. Who is greedy. Period. 
Take care and good luck.